Hello, today I'm gonna mm, teach you how to make your first DS game. Um, you're gonna go to www.dsgamemaker.com, okay? I'll post the link in the description. You're just gonna quickly go to that, and download it. You're gonna install the chip tool chain and all that. Then you should be able to open it up. Let me just. So, resource, add sprite, and add background, add background, add background, add background, add room, add, add room, do you already have three sprites, three of, um, three of, um, three of, um, uh, you should have three of everything, sprite one, you're gonna load, tutorial, there should be a folder named tutorial, blue ball, open, two, load, tutorial, green ball, open, three, tutorial, red ball, open, background one, tutorial, yeah, um, background one, tutorial, Background one load tutorial. Sorry for that. Mix. Background one load tutorial game background. Background two load tutorial. When actually make that lose background. Background three load tutorial. Win background. Background one, you should be in room one first of all. Look on background one. Room two, background two, go down. Room three, background three, go down. Oh yeah, you should put that up too. So, okay, good. Now we're gonna go to room one. We're gonna click on actions. That you should open up sprites and control slash budget. Click on. Okay, first of all, you're gonna have to put your sprites down. Put them down in random locations. Okay. You can put them down anywhere on the screen that you like. I'm just putting it in that order because I like that. Then you're going to open up room 1. Click on Actions. Click on If Collision. Screen bottom between Sprite 0 and Sprite 2. Sprite 0 and Sprite 2. Actually, before that, we're going to click on Moves bright by stylus. Sorry about all the mixes. Sprite number zero. Add that. I go to with collision. Sprite bottom. Sprite zero and sprite two. Switch room <coughs> to room two. Okay, I see that. I'll click on end up. Don't forget that. Gonna go down, click on if collision, screen button, sprite zero, and then of course this must be sprite one. It has a sprite number right here. So this must be sprite one, of course, so sprite one. Add that in. Then you're gonna go to switch room round three. Go to end if. Good, you're done with that room. Room 2, actions, if button press, state new press, button A, <coughs> switch room, room 1, and then do that exact same thing right here, and room 3, if button press, state new press, button A, switch room, room 1, add that in, 
at the end of the game. We're going to have to wait for this to finish up. <coughs> Well, it compiles. You should just wait for a few seconds. It shouldn't take too long. It actually depends on all the sprites that you have and all the backgrounds that you have and all the rooms that you have. The more that you have, the longer it will take to compile. Press any key to continue, and this should open up. See, you move the blue ball. If you go to the red, you lose, and if you go to the green, you win. You just created your first game. Thank you for watching. Please watch my other videos.